The bright star you occasionally see in the southwest around dark is the second planet, Venus. The Earth and Venus are approximately the same size, and Venus is often called Earth's twin. Twin? I mean, consider just these three things about Venus. The average temperature is 900 degrees Fahrenheit. It rains sulfuric acid, and the weight of the atmosphere is 90 times the weight of the Earth's atmosphere. The Earth, like Venus, has an atmosphere. From orbit, the setting sun makes our atmosphere obvious. The atmosphere of Venus reflects a lot of sunlight, which is why it is so very bright when it is in our sky. Venus isn't always over there in the west. Sometimes it isn't anywhere at all, and sometimes it is visible in the east in the morning before the sun comes up. At present, we would call Venus an evening star, a while before the sun sets. At other times, we see Venus in the east before the sun rises. This is why Venus is sometimes referred to as a morning star. So, do we ever see Venus high up overhead in the night sky? No. This is because of Venus's location closer to the Sun. The same is true for Mercury, but that's another story. You can see that Venus is only ever visible when it is to the right or left of the Sun. In front of the Sun, we can't see it. Behind the Sun, we can't see it. When it is right, or left of the sun, it will be an evening or morning star. How large or bright it is, and how far from the sun it gets, is determined by which of these locations we see, but it will never get far up into the sky. And so the planet Venus can put on quite a show, sometimes in the evening and sometimes in the morning, but always worth the view.